I'm Stephanie Griffin and I'm 31. Um, I get up about 7 o'clock in the morning and um, have a shower, have some breakfast really quickly and then get my two daughters up um, who are one and two. Um, I then drive to Croy train station and get the train to Glasgow. Um, it takes about 12 minutes. I'm usually at Queen Street station for um, just after 8 and then depending on how lazy I feel I either walk to Bath Street or um, get the train to Charing Cross. I start work at half past 8 in the morning um, and my first task is usually checking my voicemails. I haven't been doing my current job for very long so um, every day is really different just now settling into um, the job and, and getting to know the people that I'm working with is a big part of my job just now. Um, the morning I answer emails and um, return phone calls and messages that um, have been left for me from the previous day. Um, I usually take a break about 11 o'clock for a cup of tea before we have a team meeting. Um, we have a team meeting every Wednesday that starts about half past 11. Um, usually lasts for about an hour, an hour and a half and it's a planning meeting going forward for the next week um, but also sort of longer term projects we're working on. Um, one of the projects I'm working on just now is a councillors conference um, which will include councillors from all over Scotland um, and trade unions and um, other interested parties. Um, and, and that really just involves, you know, booking venues and going to see venues and we're really just at the beginning stages of that just now. Um, after my team meeting it's usually lunchtime and I'll go and buy a lentil soup at the um, cafe around the corner and a dry roll. Um, and I eat my lunch at my desk which we're encouraged not to do but I feel like I've got too much on not to so um, that's normally what I'll do. In the afternoon, um, I usually work on materials for councillors, um, newsletters and leaflets and you know things surrounding particular campaigns in local areas um, and aside from that work on um, localising the 2017 general election manifesto um, for, for local councils to be taken forward in the next year. Um, at the moment I'm also currently trying to um, sort of streamline their manifestos ahead of the local government budget settlements which will be happening again in February and that's a really difficult task um, because every area is different. Um, a Wednesday is really the only day that I'm in the office so that I get that time to sit down and um, work through the written paperwork and the, the manifestos. Other days when I'm in work I'm, I'm usually sort of out and about um, at councils all over the country. Um, I normally finish work around 6pm and by that point I'm definitely too tired to walk back to Queen Street Station so I get the train from Charing Cross back to Queen Street and then get my train um, back to Croy Station. My husband usually picks me up at the station because he's in by that time and um, I'll come home, have a quick dinner if it's been a long day at work usually um, something healthy like a salad try to but um, if nothing's been made for me coming in I'll just have some toast um, and then I try to uh, walk around Broadwood Loch with my girls most nights to try and get a bit of exercise um, so I have to get them ready, get them in the buggy um, and we'll do that and we take the dog as well. Um, usually by that point it's maybe about 8 o'clock so uh, I put both the girls in the baths together get them out, get their jammies on, put them to bed and by that point I'm ready for my own bed. So um, I usually make a cup of tea, go to bed and read a book and sometimes if I have the energy for it I have a conversation with my husband but that doesn't happen very often. Um, and my bedtime's usually around about 10pm.